New tonight at 11, a somber night for the Worthington community as hundreds come together to remember a 16-year-old who tragically died on a school trip to the beach. The body of Eric Clark was pulled from the ocean just off the coast of South Carolina on Monday, where he was reported missing a day earlier. NBC4's Jason Aubrey live at Worthington, where just a short while ago, a candlelight vigil ended for the teenager. Jason. Tonight's vigil drew hundreds of people wanting to pay their respects and honor the memory of a young man they cared deeply for. This was not how the students and staff of Thomas Worthington High School had planned to start their summer. This summer, we were just going to be leaders, just lead the team, try to get the team to greatness. Escorting the family of Eric Clark into the cafeteria of their high school, they then contemplated the loss of their friend. He helped me through a lot of situations. Their teammate. He's one of the main reasons why, why I joined the football team. Their pupil. Eric liked to just pay attention to the discussion and not really take notes, so a lot of times I'd try and stump him and never could do it. He's a very, very sharp young man. Everyone here, whether inside or outside, would tell you Clark had so much potential that he was taken from this world far too soon. We started the journey together, so I'm just I'm going to finish it for him. Moving forward may not be easy, but it will occur. When it does, the Thomas Worthington High School community will lean on each other as they try to be Clark Strong, something that will likely be the mantra in the fall when football is played beneath the Friday night lights. Every day in the locker room, every day on the field before games, every day before preparation, is going to be all for Eric. Over the last 24 hours, the GoFundMe page set up by Clark's family has nearly reached its $25,000 goal. That money will be used to help pay to bring his body home for funeral arrangement costs and to help support the family as they recover, taking some time off after this very difficult, difficult ordeal. Live in Worthington, Jason Aubrey, NBC4. Thank you, Jason.